what is going on everybody welcome back to my youtube channel today's video is also going to be about some designing stuff if you want your app to keep users hooked then you must provide them with a great user experience in this video i'm going to show you how to convert your boring design into more interactive one so without any further ado let's get started First of all, add this dependency and sync the project. Then go to your activity and change this to coordinator layout. Then add app bar layout here and fill its attributes. For aesthetics, go to colors.xml and change colors according to your requirements. These colors will also affect toolbar in our app. Then add a collapsing toolbar layout. It is a wrapper for toolbar which implements a collapsing app bar. It is designed to be used as a direct child of an app bar layout. This type of layout is commonly seen in the profile screen of WhatsApp application. Then for the toolbar title, go to styles.xml and add text color primary and set your desired color. Now I will add the image which I intend to display here. After that, I will set my actual toolbar. Then I will add nested scroll view for the rest of my layout which I will implement later on.
Another important thing which I want to show you guys is a disappearing view. Let's add a floating action button here which let's say will have an option to add in the cart. Now here is the property which is layout underscore anchor, align it with app bar. Now it is still looking kind of boring so what we can do is that we can create customized backgrounds for our views. So let's make a background gradient for collapsing toolbar. Then add a round edge shaped background for our nested scroll view. After this go to main activity and add the backgrounds to the views and layouts accordingly. Now our collapsing toolbar is implemented but I want to show you that how even a simple layout can look so interactive and eye catching using this collapsing toolbar. I have already designed a simple dummy layout using an image view and a couple of text views only. So I will copy this and paste it here in between my nested scroll view. Now I want a customized button so I will make a background for my button. Now I forget one thing that I should have done at the beginning of the video but anyways go to your styles.xml file and change this to no action bar and then run the project. So as you can see that our activity is working absolutely fine. And this is it for today. If you like my content then drop me a like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel either. Have a nice day. I will see you guys in the next video.